Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. It's me, Cory, and for today's video, it's a new pen day. So I'm gonna add this to my March pens and inks. It's the Kaweco Sage Green. So um, it I'm a bit hesitant to take a video on this because it's uh, it's just normal having a Kaweco. Um, and also I, I have already you know um, completed my March um, pen and inks lineup, but this um, particular Twisby is already running out of ink so I decided to clean this up this has not been clean uh, ever since it's bought and inked so it's I guess four four months six months I'm not sure so this will rest and I will use the same ink which is the Richuya Sailor Shikiori um, series so so I can continue this ink on the same March lineup. So before that, I'd like to share with you my um, novelty edition, or they call it uh, what they call it, um, Kaweco Collection pens. So this is my fourth one. Now, what is the significant about this release is that the color it's new, but um, they always normally release books i mean sorry uh, pens in this normal box so the normal means the normal colors i got here <laughs> these are just the classic uh kawekos unless it's um the al sport one so let me know so this is my fourth uh kawekos kaweko collection i have the uh, dark olive and the cyan and the iridescent so this so far is the best ink i mean pen and ink combination i've used in my entire kaweko collection so you see it's called kaweko collection but in their normal box it's just the logo the name in the details so I'm not sure what's so special on this maybe it's a release in between their seasonal release I'm not sure but also I have a question guys what's the Kaweco and the Kaweco difference of the pronunciation if you know comment down below um, maybe it's just the country pronounce how it's pronounced I'm not sure but yeah let's just go with the kaweko for now <laughs> so let's start too much rumbling this is nothing exciting when you open it you'll just get the box I got a free sticker of this but I can't find it anywhere the block the block because I this is delivered together with my sailor pro gear slim mini so yeah the the sticker is wrong misplaced <laughs> This comes with the plastic and the barcode, so yeah. Smooth, sage, and fine. Let me put this aside. And yes, I'm keeping the boxes, by the way, just in case in the future if I want to let go of them. It's live. It still comes with a box, so let's check everything. I haven't totally checked it. The logo is there. And yes, it comes with this Kaweko collection. Where in in the normal, it just say, I'll just show you guys in case some of you are still thinking of buying a Kaweko, Kaweko Sport. Yeah, so this is a Kaweko collection in the cup, embedded in the cup. So this is the say smooth sage anything green browns and so i don't use the green free on this normally i drain this you know and put my desired ink so let's keep it aside and i've prepared my free 
converter. I mean free because it's rotating. I don't have all the converters in my calicles. So for today's video and pen test and review, I'm gonna just use a converter. It's teeny tiny so, so let's prepare to ink this baby because normally I don't ink my new pens but I want to include this in my March lineup so let us try to ink this with the Sailor Shikiori Richuya greens we are into greens guys for this month and so I didn't get much I'm gonna pull one more time yep now it's there and my reliable <laughs> dirtiest color. I will also add this clip a classic retro clip I forgot the actual model because there's two clips for Kaweko so you see guys it's so pretty now let's do the pen test it's not waste paper so this is the previous video <laughs> and let's check on this new color code okay as you can see guys i will give you a closer oh it's really also a smooth light turn. Mm. Nice ink combination. Smooth, sage, and fine. Now I know. I like fine in the Kawaiko's number. I used to have a lot of EF. See? But no, this is EF. So it's pretty much good nib so I'm thinking now maybe this should this Kaweco collection is a far better quality nib than the usual sport don't quote me on that but yeah I this is just my observation sailor Shikiori Richu Rick Oh my god, I keep pronouncing it wrong. So sorry about that. Mm -hmm. And then let's do my scratchiness. Pretty much wet writer. As you can see. And daylight saving, guys. For those of you who are affected I'm not sure if it's good or bad today I think is the start okay mm. olive green so yeah it's not that much but anywho I will just use it just to replace my retiring tweets B for this set yeah. so so far so good no skipping, no hard start, no scratchiness. The writing experience on this Rodia is 10 out of 10. Yeah. There was just a bit of ink. Um, what do you call that? Splats here and there, but so far, all good. All good to go just in the beginning the ink mess <laughs> so don't dip guys um, you can use this syringe blunt syringe but I was doing the shortcut not ideal for this video okay I hope I've shown you how it writes So just to compare, this is my other Kaweco Sport, the Mint, which is the older one, the older version. 
it's really not close to the green one it's more of yeah bluish very light blue and this is the um, fairy silver press sage green as well so to me i hope i'm not colorblind but the color of the kiweko is more fuller more solid uh, green than the ferris wheel press they both have this foiling what do you call this um, branding here but the ferris wheel press is slowly slowly um, you know coming off in the letter s so, um but plastic wise this is obviously a twist cup and this is a Cup. so this is um, quality wise I feel Kaweko is more premium yeah this to me is can become can be compared to a parkeo but not the writing experience because I also love the writing experience on this but for color comparison the Kaweko is more I don't know if you can see it is more brighter sage green and then the ferris wheel is a duller part a dull green or lighter i'm very bad with um the terms in combining the color and describing the colors but yeah see in the natural lighting this is the color comparison of the sage green so yeah i hope you can see if you're a fan of greens and sage greens so this is my way of sharing with you my newest addition to the green family <laughs> my kawekos in my last fountain pen collection you can see that my galen leather 10 pen case kaweko for kaweko pens um I missed one slot so this will complete that and yeah so I hope you enjoyed today's um, video on my new pen and for those who love Kawaiko's um, please do share what you have I know there is one youtuber inside Kimmy's mind she has a lot of Kawaiko's and she recently purchased a yellow one Tokyo bike and I'm seeing it and looking at it and still in doubt which uh, one i will let go but let's see it's it's a special edition but yeah i don't know what's with yellow i'm drawn to it recently <laughs> lately so i'll see you on my next video and please do like if you like this video and subscribe to my channel i'm seeing a lot of views already in my um some of my fountain pen videos and i really really thank you guys i hope you do subscribe so imagine if i i get a 2000 views and you know i only have to 200 subscribers so i really really appreciate it if you can click the subscribe i promise to give you good content every week I'll see you on my next one. Bye!